So from Brian to Brian, let's talk a little bit about uh, what's happening in our forecast today. Let's do it, yeah, because there's a lot going on. We got snow in the mountains. We got windy conditions here around Puget Sound. We have a threat of th thunderstorms coming up here uh, later on today as well. First things first, let's talk rain because we got the radar going on here. Just some light showers along the I-5 corridor up just east of LaConnor and west of Big Lake uh, as you work your way into Skagit County. Now, out along the coastline, I'm keeping track of this here. This is our next little system that's going to be pushing through, or our next wave of showers, rather, that's pushing through. And this could produce some thunderstorms or some heavy rain. And with that, today from the Storm Prediction Center, it's national organization, usually we don't often see this marginal risk of severe thunderstorms. Severe thunderstorms can produce hail and strong localized wind and lots of lightning and yes, even tornadoes. So a marginal risk, not, not, a, not a huge risk, but it's there. That's the point of this. We also have a chance of thunderstorms here in this light green area, which includes the Puget Sound area. So wind gusts, that's been the story all morning long. Everett still gusting between 35 and 40 miles an hour. Seattle and SeaTac a little bit calmer along with Olympia and Tacoma. Tacoma did gust along the Narrows Bridge up to uh, around 50, 51 mile an hour wind gusts uh, around 6 o'clock this morning. So it has been a windy morning for everybody. We do have a lot of power outages still out there. Schools delayed and canceled and all of that. 40s for everybody right now on the west side of the Cascades. And let's get into today's forecast for Seattle, Tacoma, Bremerton, and the Lowlands. Showers at times it will continue to remain breezy, although those winds are going to die down a little bit later on here this afternoon. So Wednesday, more dry than wet. Good news there. Thursday, that's Veterans Day. Here comes an atmospheric river once again. Lots of rain Thursday night and throughout Friday. And then we're back to showers for next weekend.